welcome to the show. I'm Kristen Chow. And I'm Cameron Word. <laughs> Are we jumping off a cliff? <laughs> jumping off a cliff. Geronimo. Okay. Are you scared of heights? Yes. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Oh. I mean, like, weirdly, mm. if I'm in a plane, mm -hmm. I'm okay. But, like, if I'm on a bridge. Yes. Or. I Roller coaster? Roller coaster is fine. Oh, it's okay. Okay. Uh, well. Kind of, sort of. Uh, mm. I used to be completely fine, but now okay. I get a little scared. Uh, but like a building. You elevator. Know what elevator is like, a little scary. Outside elevator. Yeah. That kind like of a thing. glass floor. Yes, glass floor. Anything with a glass floor. <sighs> Oof. No, thank you. No, thank you. What about um, you? Um, Not too much. Really? Not too much. I, I think I'm okay, but I don't think I would bungee jump or skydive do any of those things see i did just i skydove once skydived once you did yeah how but you're sk I, I was just one time so that was the thing mm. going up in the plane i was fine mm. and then the jump is when it got scary that's right yeah yeah but uh yeah flights are not my thing yeah. i had to do a filming one time mm. where i was on a tower this was in korea in the <gasps> southern part and I had to go up a tower, oh. and they sh tied your back to the tower. Okay. And you leaned across. Oh, okay. That okay. And you had to walk around the circle, the top part of the tower. Uh, hanging off. Okay, that's. It was terrifying. That that's too scary. Terrifying. Oh, I would. Oh, they better, they better have paid you a lot of money for that. Yeah, it was. Yeah. It was, okay. it was good right, money. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. Taking an eco cruise. I was face to face with a sea lion. Mm. If you are face to face with something, how I mean, are you? You are looking at it directly. Mm. You are. It's right in front of you. Okay. Um. Uh, if you are in the wild, what is that? This means that you're in the place where you're basically outside in yeah. nature. In nature. You're not in a zoo. That's right. You're not in an apartment building. That's right. <laughs> you're out where there is no civilization. Yes. So it's like, you know, in the wild does feel like maybe you're in the forest or you're in a jungle or mm. you're in the desert. You know, mm -hmm. there aren't any buildings around. Yes. Okay, here's an interesting expression. Will wonders never cease? C-E-A-S-E? -E? Yes. So, will wonders never cease? It's nothing that was expected at all, mm -hmm. but it's kind of a sarcastic way of saying, mm -hmm. like, oh my goodness, I can't believe this exists. Mm -hmm. It's not always used truthfully. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and check out these expressions as you can hear them in the dialogue. Let's listen. That was so exciting. I can't believe I was face to face with a sea lion. I'm glad that a professional nature photographer was there to give helpful tips on shooting photos in the wild. While you were taking pictures, the nature guide explained the differences between the species of sea lions on South Georgia Island. Will wonders never cease? I don't remember the last time you were this interested in nature. You were right about this cruise, Jordan. Wait until we see the emperor penguins in a few days. Angela begins by saying, that was so exciting. I can't believe I was face to face with a sea lion. So, if you are face to face with a wild animal, mm -hmm. it can be kind of dangerous. Uh, yeah, I can. Mm -hmm. Depending on, like, if it's a aggressive animal yeah. or not. All right. So, face to face means you are looking at it. Mm -hmm. You are very close to it. Mm -hmm. and, and you're... Cl like you're pretty cl close yeah you're close you mm -hmm. can see things mm -hmm. i mean technically mm -hmm. face to face means you're touching faces yeah right right but we don't often use it that way mm -hmm. it's more just like we were so close it's like we could touch each other's face i was in tanzania mm -hmm. in the serengeti yes i was in a tent mm -hmm. and i was sitting outside the tent yes having coffee and an elephant charged up 
Oh no! And it was like like up the hill, uh-huh. and like literally stopped uh-huh. and did like a in front of us. Uh-huh. Like we were literally a hundred like meters away. Like it was not that far away, uh-huh. and we were like. Okay, don't move, don't move. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. Wow. It kind of took my breath away. Like, mm-hmm. are we going to die? It was that feeling. Because usually when you're on a safari, you're in a Jeep. You're, you know, you can drive away. But yeah. you're there sitting down and this elephant comes. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It was incredible. That had to be so cool. It was actually very cool. Yeah. That is the idea of face-to-face. So it's like, it's not that you're literally, it's that close, but it is close proximity. It is close distance. Right. It almost feels close in like a mm, uncomfortable way. Yeah. Like it's closer than you should be that. with that animal or True. with that thing. So yeah. I'm sure like if it was a snake... Mm-hmm. Which is dangerous, yeah. but it's at the same distance that the elephant was. Uh-huh. You may not say face to face, yeah, because like it, because the snake is smaller, it feels yeah. like more distance, right? Right, right, right. right. If the, the snake would have to be like a few feet. Oh, away I've had from that you. before too. Yeah. Rattlesnake. Yeah, right. You come face to face with a rattlesnake. Uh, oh my god, I have been in very dangerous look situations. At you. You're like Indiana Jones, <laughs> like Jane Goodall. Okay. All right. Jordan, let us continue. I'm glad that a professional nature photographer was there to give helpful tips on shooting photos in the wild. So, of course, if you are in the wild, you will come face to face with these wild animals, Mm. right? So what is this in the wild? In the wild means in in nature. So a lot of photography is done in a studio. Yeah. And you can control things. You can control lighting, the wind. If you're in the wild, Uh you can't control anything. That's right. You know, I mean, National Geographic photographers are, Uh I mean, so famous because they they take these pictures in the wild. Yes. Right? Mm. And they go to great lengths to do that. Mm. Okay, so to be in the wild is like wild nature. Yes. Okay. Angela says, while you were taking pictures, the nature guide explained the differences between the species of sea lions on South Georgia Island. Mm. Okay, our power vocab today is species. Yes, mm-hmm. and you, this is another word you pronounce differently. Yeah. You say species. Yeah. I say species. Oh, species, yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. both I have heard, mm-hmm. so if you say either of those, it's correct. And it's a, a type, it's a type of animal. Yeah. Technically, it's chung. Chung. Right? <laughs> yeah, right, right. So, is it like, you know how they have, like, oh. kingdom, phylum, order, class, family, genus, species? Oh, my gosh. It's like the, the what is it? The animal kwa kingdom? Chung, the kwa, chung, chung kwa, 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 kwa mo, okay. mun. Okay. They're, they're all, like, the scientific categories yes. that they have. Yeah. Species is, like, the, the most detailed. Most detailed, right? right. Okay. Well, look at you. Dr. Word. <laughs> Dr. Okay. Word. <laughs> we've got like Jane Goodall Wait. and we've got like a full on scientist in oh, here. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. So Jordan finally says, Will wonders never cease? Mm. Okay. So cease, C E A S E, which means it's another fancy word for stop. Yeah. Okay. Like cease fire. Yeah. Which is used in, like, war, yeah. you know, when there's mm-hmm. a ceasefire, it means, like, no one is shooting. Yeah, stop shooting. Weaponry, mm-hmm. okay? So, will wonders never cease? What does this mean? This is a phrase that you say when you're surprised that something happened. Yeah. You would not expect something to happen. So, you're like, wow, I can't what? believe this. Yeah. Will wonders never cease? I love the Korean translation we have in our book. Yeah. Like, the, the the sun is coming up from the west. Yeah, it's like so amazing and like. Yeah, I can't believe I can't that this believe happened. It. Yes, yeah. yes. So he says, I don't remember the last time you were in this interested in nature. Mm. I don't remember the last time is our power pattern. Yes, this means it has been a long time since. Mm-hmm. So, uh, Angela being interested in nature it's not something that she does or is often Mm -hmm. so he's like saying wow it's really rare 
for you to be interested in nature like、mm-hmm. this. I don't remember the last time right, you were、right. interested in nature. So Angela is just like. Wow! Oh my gosh! You know, like just so, just remember, she was the one that said, like, "Oh gosh, do we have to do this?"、Mm. But now it seems like she's very interested. Yes. So Angela says, "You were right about this cruise, Jordan."、Mm-hmm. And, And Jordan ends with, "Wait until we see the emperor penguins in a few days." I think if you go on a cruise, yeah, this is, sounds really nice. To、Don't. be able to see all of these wild animals、yeah. in their natural habitat. Well, that's what I hear. Like、yeah. the cruise itself, being on the boat after a couple of days, it's、yeah. not really fun. Right. It's the places you go. That's right. The ports that you like,、True. kind of go out and explore. Yeah.、Mm. All right. Let's go ahead and listen to that again. That was so exciting! I can't believe I was face to face with a sea lion. I'm glad that a professional nature photographer was there to give helpful tips on shooting photos in the wild. While you were taking pictures, the nature guide explained the differences between the species of sea lions on South Georgia Island. Will wonders never cease? I don't remember the last time you were this interested in nature. You were right about this cruise, Jordan. Wait until we see the emperor penguins in a few days. It's time for power note. If you are face to face with something,、mm-hmm. means that you are in direct contact. You're in the same location. If you're face to face with a wild animal, it's、uh-huh. you're pretty close. You're looking them down the nose, yeah, <laughs> as they say. Yeah. Or if you meet a person face to face, meaning you see them in person. Yes. It's great to finally meet face to face. Yeah, those dating apps are kind of impersonal. Yeah,、mm. right. So if you're meeting face to face, it just means that it is not online but offline. Yep. The woman was face to face in the courtroom with the man who stole her car. Oh, so this isn't maybe necessarily distance related. Yeah. But she's in the same room with that man.、Yeah. She's looking at, and because. Often, what they do, the criminal and the the victim, they don't see each other That's often, right? right? right. But right. in the courtroom, they're often face to face. And true story,、mm. I've got a lot of stories today. Look at you. Yeah,、uh, the robber. Uh huh. We got robbed. <gasps> you did? When I was in junior high school. <gasps> do you know it was our neighbor who lived in another complex? Uh huh. And like, they found who it was. <gasps> The police like caught him、uh-huh. taking our TV. Yeah, and we were face, face to face. face in the courtroom with this guy. Wow, it was the scariest thing. Did you know him before? Well, I've seen him around. <gasps> yeah,、wow. and we had to testify like that he was our neighbor. <gasps> That's I remember.、Crazy. I remember, and then we had our neighbor who was like a Scottish. You know, Highlander, and he had a gun. I saw them taking their TV. <laughs> yeah, he's like, "What's going on?" You know? What's going on? They took their robbers, took their TV. <laughs> yeah. So going face to face can kind of feel a bit dangerous. Yeah. Depending on the situation,、mm. but simply it could be just like in person. Yeah. Meeting face to face. You can even be face to face with destiny. Destiny. Oh. Like that moment. Ooh. When everything is just it's. You're, it's meant to be. The Whitney Houston song.、Yeah. One moment in time. Yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah. Anthony. That kind of like that one moment、uh-huh. that、your、could change your life forever.、Mm. If you just succeed,、mm. that you could say you're face to face with destiny. Oh, it's very poetic. Uh huh. If you are in the wild, it is like a natural environment,、mm. like it's nature. Yes. Without any untouched nature,、mm-hmm. okay.、Uh, look, there's a family of deer. This is way better than the zoo. Seeing animals in the wild is so satisfying. But remember, don't feed them. Do not feed the animals in the wild.、Mm. Monkeys in the wild act very differently than they do as pets. Yeah, <gasps> you know what I heard? What? So you know how like wolves? There's like the alpha wolf. Yeah. Beta. Pack. And、yeah. there's like omega. Yeah, right. That's not really a thing in the wild. Really? So yeah. Oh. Apparently, this whole the researcher who found out the, like the alpha wolf、yeah. and alpha dog. Yeah. That's only when they're in zoos. Oh. 
because it's like a oh. an artificial environment. So like the normal wolf behavior uh -huh. goes crazy. Oh. And they kind of it's like a jail. Oh. So like how jails have the the really? hierarchy. Really? Yeah. <gasps> In the wild, they're not like that. It's not, it's mostly Community. just a, it's a family. Oh wow. So there's like the mom and a dad mm. and then all of the children, mm. they kind of have their role. <gasps> so depending on what they're doing, they're like, "Oh, you're the leader right now." Or like, "Oh, they change." Yeah. In the wild, so many animals like act differently than they do when they're in the zoo. I would imagine. Yeah. Oh my gosh, so we're making like alpha wolf and beta wolves yeah. and omega wolves. But apparently in the, zoo? the researcher who did this, mm. he got famous for that. And then he found out he was wrong and he spent the rest of his career trying to correct the incorrect information that he put out oh my goodness but everyone only remembers the first thing he did oh this is very interesting yeah thank you dr word uh. <laughs> <laughs> maybe we need to go back to the wild we do if humans went back into the wild yeah. we'd probably act different i think so too live in a tree i, I agree we'd be nuts, free eating fruit who nuts. cares about order who cares about giving orders or taking orders <laughs> Okay, will wonders never cease? Mm. This is when you're like, you know, oh, this is not at all ex I expected. Yeah. You're just like, I can't believe this happened. I can't uh, believe you finally did this. Wow, okay. Uh. Hey, Dad, I cleaned my room. Can we go get pizza now? Will wonders never cease? You finally did what I asked you to do. So it's actually used sarcastically. It's like, oh, you finally cleaned your room. Oh, my gosh. I've been asking you for months. <laughs> what a miracle. You remembered my birthday? Will wonders never cease? You, Meaning, yeah. you always forget my birthdays. And our anniversary. <laughs> and Christmas. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, our power pattern today is I don't remember the last time. Mm. Yes. It's been so long. It's been so It's so rare that this happens. Yeah. I don't remember the last time the sea was this calm. I don't remember the last time you laughed at my jokes. Yeah. It's like you never do, but wow, you did. Yeah. You, our relationship has been bad, and you have not been happy around me. <laughs> right. Can't remember the last time you laughed at my jokes. All right. Our power vocab is species or species. species. Okay. Both are acceptable. Do check out the definition on page 102. Mm -hmm. Let's thank our sponsor. Hanguk Toik Bionwa.